everybody. Hope you're having a wonderful day or evening or middle of the night. I don't know. I don't know where you are on the planet. My name is Bobby. I was already said that. I'm old. Give it to me, babe. Today, this episode is about sitting in stillness. Yes, sitting in stillness. That is the hardest thing that I had to learn. Sounds ridiculous. Well, loving myself is probably the, the most difficult, oddly enough. But sitting in stillness. Man, I always thought that was kind of ridiculous. I'm sorry. When I was younger, my energy was a little different. But the thing was, I, I could just... Meditation, I was like, they're what? They're just sitting there. Huh? Oh, okay. Doing what? Eyes Oh, they're closing their eyes. There's actually things they're doing. Man. Oh. I'm sorry. I just... The thing, I, I thought that whole um, Tai Chi, the thing when they're in the park and they're all old people and they're just like, I thought that was cool. I'm not sure about the whole motivation, but I, I dig it. It's exercise. I, I think that's cool. It's a, that's a form of meditation, I think. So that's kind of cool. So I didn't really get into it, but not making fun of it. But for me, okay, being an emperor, the empress, the world comes to you. Expect miracles expect blessings because you've earned it you didn't you didn't you know how hard it is to be an emperor and empress in this age in this day with all the knuckleheads running around god bless them it, it's tough to recognize that within yourself and then treat yourself accordingly no oh, man you earned it and it's been rough, babe. I've earned it. So the hardest thing for me to do is sit in stillness. Do nothing. Because that's another thing. That's another part of the conditioning. Episode 2500. No, just kidding. Uh, uh, anyways, yeah, it's part of the conditioning. Like my father, he was a worker. He was a worker bee. For lack of a better word. His, his self-worth was in his job. Working for a living, making an earning, bringing home that coin—that was his. That was his value to society. That's how he thought of himself. That was all he thought of himself. Nothing more. You see what I'm saying? That's all he thought he was worth to society. Is I got to make sure I earn a living. So for me, as the emperor, to know that I'm already worth it, I don't have to prove it. shit nobody please sorry thank you very much take a number and I'll get to you you know what I'm saying the Emperor or Empress you've earned the right to sit in your power sit in your stillness and do absolutely nothing and not feel an ounce of guilt about it too that's that's a sweet spot you know cuz I used to do that cuz I'd be like if I'm not working I'm looking for work you know, which is just, it's just shit. I'm sorry. But like I said, we all need to work at some point. I'm 51. I've done my thing. You know what I mean? When I'm 25, you you, you earn. You, you earn, right? You do your thing. You get out there in the world. You make your mark. You earn your stripes. That's cool. That's part of it. But you know what I mean? That's when you're 20. And when you're 30, you, you earn your way, right? You earn the right to speak up in the crowd and for people to listen now and to believe what the fuck you have to say, right? But when you become emperor and empresses, you've earned it. And sitting in your stillness. Whew, that's like for me, it's the hardest thing. It's just sitting in my stillness, knowing that I'm worth gold, baby. I am, I am priceless in my stillness. And it's not narcissism either. It's, it's not ego. That's the beauty of it. It's literally just loving yourself. There's, and there is a difference, baby. There's loving yourself in a healthy, beautiful way that nobody else has ever done before and that makes you empowered and it only makes you stronger as an emperor or empress. You're not out there being a dick to people. You're not out there putting anybody down. 
You're giving hugs and kisses, baby. You're out there making people feel good about themselves. Everybody I meet, I treat them like they are the emperor or empress. They are amazing. I'm always saying, you're awesome. And it, I, you know what I mean? It's energy, and if you throw out that kind of energy, it's gonna, it's, people are gonna be like, ooh. You know, maybe I am an emperor, an empress. You know what I mean? Which you are. But don't take no for an answer. You're an emperor, empress. Pff, done. Don't matter whether you're scrubbing toilets or, or throwing fries out the window to somebody sitting in the car. You know what I mean? Whatever you do, you're an awesome. Period. In a story. And then this is this moment, and then you move on, you grow, and you become something else. And you're CEO, or whatever your company. After you're done throwing fries or scrubbing the toilets. You know what I'm saying? Earn your stripes and become the emperor or empress of your universe. Whew, and then learn to sit in stillness and do nothing, which is kind of fun. I mean, it's, it, I'm not going to say it's boring. I'm learning to enjoy that stillness and to actually appreciate that because I'm going to be busy in a minute. I know I am. So, so I'm going to enjoy this moment. <sighs> the ocean waves and I'm going to get, I'm going to get rock. Tomorrow's going to be a busy day. So we'll see. So right now I'm just gonna sit in my stillness and then we're gonna rock this. We got stuff to do, people. We got, you know what I mean? We still got stripes to earn. Just because we, you're emperor, empress doesn't mean you, you're st you're done giving, you're done hugging, kissing, loving, telling people how amazing they are. Every moment you live on this earth, your job is to make other people feel better. Be of service. Namaste. And have a wonderful day. I love you. God loves you, and the universe is still digging you. So. Yeah, rocket. Goodbye. Okay,